energy from the walkout. The energy from the walkout. And build a people's movement. And build a people's movement. To take power back. To take power back. From the 1%. From the 1%. Because another world is possible. Because another world is possible. Here at NYU. Here at NYU. We're having teach-ins. We're having teach-ins. To educate the community. To educate the community. On our role in this movement. On our role in this movement. Our administrations. Our administrations. Just like our political leaders. Just, just like our political leaders. Don't know what democracy looks like. Don't know what and acknowledge. We, we need, need to respect and acknowledge the indigenous population and cultures of this continent. The indigenous populations and cultures of this continent. Yeah. I am here because no revolution is possible. I am here because no revolution is possible without recognizing and working to end. Without recognizing and working to end. Racism. Racism. Sexism. Sexism. Homophobia. Homophobia. Transphobia. Transphobia. Ableism. Ableism. Colonialism. Colonialism. Xenophobia. Xenophobia. And all other forms of oppression. And all other forms of oppression. This country was built. This country was built. By rich, wealthy white men. By rich, wealthy white men. Built on the back of slaves. Built on the back of slaves. To protect the interests. To protect the interests. Of the one percent. Of the one percent. The oppression of marginalized people. The oppression of marginalized people. Is systematic. Is systematic. And occurs at all levels of the government. And it occurs at all levels of the government. We see this in the police force. We see this in the police force. It targets racial minorities. It targets racial minorities. The police force. The police force. Which has been which has been attacking. Which has been attacking. Occupy Wall Street protesters. Occupy Wall Street protesters. Has focused on women. Has focused on women. I was thrown into a car. I was thrown into a car. By a police officer who called me a faggot. By a police officer who called me a faggot. I know that people of color in this movement. I know that people of color in this movement face even greater risks. Makes even greater, greater risk of violence, of violence, violence and arrest. arrest. There's the story of Justin Atkins. There's the story of Justin Atkins. A trans man. A trans man. One of those arrested on the Brooklyn Bridge. One of those arrested on the Brooklyn Bridge. He was segregated from the prison population. He was segregated from the prison population. Denied food and water. Denied food and water. Not allowed to use the restroom. Not allowed to use the restroom. For 11 hours. For 11 hours. As marginalized people. As marginalized people. We need to make sure. We need to make sure. Our voices are heard. Our voices are heard. Within every movement. Within every movement. We are told we are being disruptive. We are told we are being disruptive. We are told we are 
are distracting. We are told we are distracting. We are told we have already achieved equality. We are told we have already achieved equality. This is why I am glad that the organizers. This is why I am glad that the organizers. Of Occupy Wall Street. Of Occupy Wall Street. Have created an anti-oppression working group. Have created an anti-oppression working group. But one group. But one group. It's not enough. It's not enough. enough to change the behavior. To change the behavior of an entire organization. Of an entire organization. I am here. I am here because I believe. Because I believe that everyone. That everyone should have access to food and shelter. Should have access to food and shelter. Education. Education. Healthcare. Healthcare. Including on-demand abortion. Including on-demand abortion. Regardless of their economic status. Regardless of their economic status. Race. Race. Sexual or gender identity. Sexual or gender identity. Immigrant status. Immigrant status. I am here in solidarity. I am here in solidarity. With the immigrants. With the immigrants. Who are afraid to protest. Who are afraid to protest. Because they fear deportation. Because they fear deportation. We are here to end the long line of oppression in this country. We are here to end the long line of oppression in this country. We are here because we're angry with the system. We are here because we're angry with the system. We're here because this generation. We are here because this generation has the power to create change. Has the power to create change. Thank you. Thank you. We're now gonna have representatives. We're now gonna have representatives from four schools that have ongoing organizing campaigns. From four schools that have ongoing organizing campaigns. I'd like to ask someone from the new school. I'd like to ask someone from the new school. Come up and join us. Come up and join us. Yeah, new school. If people can move forward, if people can move forward, more people will be able to hear. More people will be able to hear. Hi everyone, my name is Joe. Hi everyone, my name is Joe. I'm a graduate student in the economics department of the NSSR. I'm a graduate student in the economics department of the NSSR. Last Friday. Last Friday. We had approximately 40 people show up. We had approximately 40 people show up. Which was three times as many. Which was three times as many. As our first meeting. As our first meeting. We're very small. We're very small. But we are progressively growing. But we are progressively growing. The problem with the new school. The problem with the new school. Is that we have so little funding. Is that, is that we have so little funding. And increasingly higher tuitions. And increasingly higher tuitions. And an administration. And an administration. Who provides no internal funding. Who provides no internal funding. And consistently tells us. And consistently tells us. That they will next year. That they will next year. This is ongoing. This is ongoing. And it will never stop. And it will never stop. Until we at the new school. Until we at the new school. Are able to finally say enough is enough. Are able to finally say enough is enough. Three years ago. Three years ago. We had occupations. We had occupations. I love this word. I love this word. Because the new school administration knows. Because the new school administration knows. It's become a household term. It's, it's become a household term. At the moment. At the moment. We're still considering all strategies. We're still considering all strategies. We are still very decentralized. We are still very decentralized. And we are working to reach out. And we are working to reach out. The various divisions and schools of the new school. The various divisions and schools of the new school. That's all I have to say for now. That's all I have to say for now. All I can say is occupy new school! Occupy new school! Hello! Hello! My name is Zoltan. My name is Zoltan. I am a graduate student. I am a graduate student. At the CUNY Graduate Center. At the CUNY Graduate Center. In anthropology. In anthropology. Yesterday. Yesterday. We organized a CUNY-wide General Assembly. We organized a CUNY-wide General Assembly. At 
Hunter College. At Hunter College. And there will be. And there will be another general assembly. Another general assembly at Hunter College. At Hunter College next week. Next week. 4 p.m. on Friday. 4 p.m. on Friday. If you are a CUNY student. If you are a CUNY student. You are welcome to join us. You are welcome to join us. Please join us. Please join us. The difficulty with CUNY, the difficulty with CUNY is that we are separated on many campuses. Is that we are separated on many campuses. We need to join together. We need to join together. Our power is in our numbers. Our power is in our numbers. Currently we are facing. Currently we are facing the prospect of tuition hikes. The prospect of tuition hikes over the course of the next five years. Over the course of the next five Years. That will disproportionately affect, that will disproportionately affect traditionally, marginalized communities in the city of New York. traditionally marginalized communities in the city of New York. We are seeing, we are seeing the, gutting the gutting of the public education system. Of the public education system. As CUNY, as CUNY, we would like to ask for all of your help. We would like to ask for all of your help. Help from the new school. Help from the new school. Help from Columbia. Help from Columbia. Help from NYU. Help from NYU. Help from Rutgers. Help from Rutgers. Help from all the schools. Help from all the schools. To save public education. To save public education. In the city of New York. In the city of New York. In the state of New York. In the state of New York. In the United States of America. In the United States of America. Thank you. Thank you. Hello everyone! Hello everyone! It's really exciting to be here! It's really exciting to be here! My name's Aquia. My name's Aquia. Wow! Wow! <laughs> and, and I'm a graduate student. I'm a graduate student at Columbia. At Columbia. And at Columbia. And at Columbia. People are very pumped. People are very pumped. To finally start doing something. To finally start doing something. About the injustices. About the injustices. That our administration is involved in. That our administration is involved in. Columbia University. Columbia University. Is infamous. Is infamous. For displacing. For displacing. Thousands of people in Harlem. Thousands of people in Harlem.
relate to other campuses. And how does it relate to other campuses? Um, to better organize around these issues. To better organize around these issues. So if you are a Columbia student or know a Columbia student, so if you are a Columbia student or know a Columbia student, please come to me or other people. Raise your hands in the crowd. Raise your hands people in the crowd. Um, around um, to figure out how you can help organize. To figure out how you can help organize. All right. Thank you very much. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. My name is Josh. My name is Josh. I'm a PhD student. I'm a PhD student in the history department at NYU. In the history department at NYU. I'm here to represent. I'm here to represent a group on campus. A group on campus that is formed in solidarity with Occupy Wall Street. That is formed in solidarity with Occupy Wall Street. A week and a half ago. A week and a half ago. This group. This group. With others at Columbia. With others at Columbia. The new school. The new school. And universities. And universities. Around the city of New York. Around the city of New York. Helped organize a walkout. Helped organize a walkout. We met in this square. We met in this square. We marched. We marched. We took Lafayette Street. We took Lafayette Street. And we joined over 60. And we joined over 60. Community and labor organizations. Community and labor organizations. Who are all in solidarity with Occupy Wall Street. Who are all in solidarity with Occupy Wall Street. Since that time. Since that time. We've been meeting. We've been meeting. We've been organizing. We've been organizing. We've been planning teachings. We've been planning teachings. We're currently. We're currently in the process of organizing. In the process of organizing a people's university. A people's university in Washington Square Park. In Washington Square Park. This will be a space. This will be a space for all of us. For all of us. To discuss our common struggle. To discuss our common struggle with academics. With academics. With students. With students. With community groups. With community groups. With our brothers and sisters. With our brothers and sisters in the labor movement. In the labor movement. We're asking all NYU students. We're asking all NYU students. Whether you're a graduate student. Whether you're a graduate student. Whether you're an undergraduate, whether you're an undergraduate, all people active in other student organizations, all people active in other student organizations, to join us, to join us in planning these exciting events, in planning these exciting events, and exciting actions, and exciting, exciting actions. Please find someone. Please find someone with a sign-up sheet. With a sign-up sheet. And put your email down. And put your email down. That will allow us to communicate with you. That will allow us to communicate with you. In an effective manner. In an effective manner. You can also. You can also. Find all of our events. Find all of our events. And organizing meetings. And organizing meetings. On Facebook. On Facebook. The name. The name. Of our page. Of our page. Is NYU. NYU. Four. Four. The number. The number. OWS. OWS. Thank you very much. I know we have a lot of other schools here today. I know we have a lot of other schools here today. I want to know who else is here. Rutgers. Say it again. Rutgers. 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 Describe your action or group. To describe your action or group. We're then going to break. 
break out. People can coordinate. So that people can coordinate. And we will reconvene. And we will reconvene. After a short time. After a short time. The stack is already starting. The stack is already starting. So if you're interested. So if you're interested. Signal to Zoltan. Signal to Zoltan. Who's first on the stack? Find him information. The question is. If this is to determine breakout groups, or just for general information, I would say it's for both. Unless there's another point of process. Does anyone have any objections? Does anyone have any objections to groups and actions making general announcements? To groups and actions making general announcements. So that's how we'll proceed. So that's how we'll proceed. But we would like to give precedence. But we would like to give precedence to student groups. To student groups and actions that are happening today. And actions that are happening today. The first person on the stack. The first person on the stack. Right, right here. The Rutgers representative. The Rutgers representative. Okay, I graduated in 06. I graduated in 06. I guess I don't count anymore. <laughs> I guess I don't count anymore. But that's fucking fucked up. But that's fucking fucked up. My tuition went. My tuition went. From 7,000. From 7,000. To 9,000. To 9,000. To 14,000. To 14,000. In five years. In five years. Um, hello, my name is Edna. Hello, my name is Edna. I'm a PhD student at uh, Princeton University. I'm a PhD student at Princeton University. I study history. I study history. I'm part of the Princeton Committee on Palestine. I'm part of the Princeton Committee on Palestine. And last night it was amazing to go to the SJP conference at Columbia. And last night it was amazing to go to the SJP conference at Columbia. People spoke about the apartheid. People spoke about the apartheid. How we can take action. And how we can take action. Last week, last week, we had a, a teach in on Occupy Wall Street in uh, Princeton University. We had a teach in on Occupy Wall Street at Princeton University. And 30 students came out. And 30 students came out. It was wonderful to see a radicalizing minority of people coming out to this demonstration to the teach in. It was wonderful to see a radicalizing minority of people coming out to the teach in. Um, people spoke about the injustices, especially the war in Iraq and Afghanistan. People spoke about the injustices, especially the war in Iraq and Afghanistan. Uh, specifically about the anti, uh, the globalization movement in the early 2000s. Especially about the anti-globalization. Mike Check. Mike Check. People spoke about the globalization movement in the early 2000s. People spoke about the globalization movement in the early 2000s. People spoke about how we can be able to try to occupy Palestine or uh, Princeton. <laughs> Occupy Princeton. Please go to our Facebook page, Occupy Princeton. Thank you. Thank you.
Hello. 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 I have some pretty good news. I have some pretty good news. My name's Lek. My name's Lek. Last week I was arrested. Last week I was arrested. This bothered my friends. This bothered my friends. They wrote to Lek Wałęsa. They wrote to Lek Wałęsa. Former president of Poland. Former president of Poland. Leader of the Solidarity Movement. Leader of the Solidarity Movement. Which was the, one of the largest strike in human history. Which was one of the largest strikes in human history. He is not only going to show support. He is not only going to show support. He will be coming here October 25th. He will be coming here October 25th. At 2.30 p.m. At 2.30 p.m. And he will be organizing unions across the city. And he will be organizing unions across the city. I propose. I propose that universities welcome him. That universities welcome him. And that we join forces. And that we join forces. Hi. Hi. My name is Biola. My name is Biola. I'm a student and organizer at Brooklyn College. I'm a student and organizer at Brooklyn College. And also a part of New York Students Rising. And also a part of New York Students Rising. Which helped, which uh, set the date for the October 5th walkout. Which set the date for the October 5th walkout. Which I hope all you guys went to. Which I hope all you guys went to. We're all about. We're all about. Uh, a more transparent CUNY and SUNY. A more transparent CUNY and SUNY. And a complete repeal of the $300 a year tuition increase. And a complete repeal of the $300 a year tuition increase. And no tuition in general. And no tuition in general. <laughs> so yeah, that's it. <laughs> I'm Bob Samuels. I'm Bob Samuels. I teach at UCLA. I teach at UCLA. I'm the faculty union president for the UC system. I'm the faculty union president for the UC system. Um, we're organizing events in California. We're organizing events in California. We've been inspired by you here. We've been inspired by you here. Two weeks ago. Two weeks ago. I was at the White House. I was at the White House. I met with the president's main advisors. I met with the president's main advisors. We talked about student debt and unemployment. We talked about student debt and unemployment. We talked about a program where students would forgive their loans. We talked about a program where students would forgive their loans. If they did community service. If they did community service. So I hope everyone pushes. So I hope everyone pushes. For real jobs bill. For a real jobs bill. That'll put 25 million. That'll put 25 million people to work. People to work. Hi, my name is Bobak. Hi, my name is Bobak. I'm with the Empowerment and Education Work Group from Wall Street. The Empowerment and Education Work Group from Wall Street. I want to announce the Gayatri Spivak. I want to announce the Gayatri Spivak. We'll speak here at 9 p.m. We'll speak here at 9 p.m. And Bronx for Change. And Bronx for Change. At 8 p.m. At 8 p.m. And the right here, yeah. Right here. Tonight, and we're lining up speakers, so. Anyway, I'll say, forget that. Um, there's also a group of doctors, medical students, and healthcare staff. There's also a group of doctors, medical students, and healthcare staff. We're assembling here for the march. We're assembling here for the march. A lot of us were not inspired by Grey's Anatomy. A lot of us were not inspired by Grey's Anatomy. To treat our patients like animals. To treat our patients like animals. Because of dehumanizing loans. Because of dehumanizing loans. Our inspiration is. Our inspiration is. Che Guevara. Che Guevara. Salvador Allende. Salvador Allende. Steve Pico. Steve Pico. So, so, loans go on for the rest of your life. Loans go on for the rest of your life. And as residents, they can be very humiliating. And as residents, they can be very humiliating. So we have to stop them now, no matter what field you go into. So we have to stop them now. Hey y'all, I'm Bobby. Hey y'all, I'm Bobby. I'm a freshman at Eugene Lang. I'm a freshman at Eugene Lang. And this, and this movement. And, and this movement. And this movement for other people of color. And this movement for other people of color. Is life and death in many ways. Is life and death in many ways. I have been stopped and frisked. I have been stopped and frisked. I have been arrested. I have been arrested. I have been brutalized by the police. I have been brutalized by the police. 
Please. All because. All because. I was participating like many of you. I was participating like many of you. Now I am with the People of Color Working Group. Now I am with the People of Color Working Group. Many of us are here. Many of us are here. And we are trying to make sure our voices get heard. And we are trying to make sure our voices get heard. Look around you. Look around you. And count the people of color on your digits. Count the people of color on your digits. My opinion, why? My opinion, why? Is because this movement has been going on since we've realized what it is to be a person of color in this country. It's because this movement has been going on since we realized what it means to be a person of color in this country. Jim Crow's alive and kicking. Jim Crow's alive and kicking. At least. At least. Let's air our grievances out. Let's air our grievances out. Come find me. Come find me. Look for the Jim Crow sign. Look for the Jim Crow sign. I'll be under that, um, pigeon, you know, sign. Thank you. Hi. Hi. I'm Annie. I'm Annie. I go to Union Theological Seminary. I go to Union Theological Seminary. A group of us. A group of us. Have started Protest Chaplains NYC. Have started Protest Chaplains NYC. Our badges look like this. Our badges look like this. We support Occupy Wall Street. We support Occupy Wall Street. Through a ministry of listening, prayer, and presence. Through a ministry of listening, prayer, and presence. If other seminarians or religious students. If the other seminarians or religious students. Want to get involved. Want to get involved. Check us out on Facebook. Check us out on Facebook. Protest Chaplains NYC. Protest Chaplains NYC. Thank you. Thank you. Hi everyone. Hi everyone. This is a really amazing crowd. This is a really amazing crowd. My name is Connor. My name is Connor. I'm a part of the CUNY system. I'm a part of the CUNY system. As a student and a teacher. As a student and a teacher. I am also a poor. I am also a poor. Puerto Rican. Puerto Rican. Queer. Queer. Kid in Harlem. Kid in Harlem. And so I support the ideas. And so I support the ideas. That this should be an anti-racist movement. That this should be an anti-racist movement. That we talk about budget cuts. That we talk about budget cuts. And their racist implications. And their racist implications. That we talk about Washington Square Park. That we talk about Washington Square Park. As a place that was gentrified. As a place that was gentrified. And that we keep that in all of our actions moving forward. And that we keep that in all of our actions moving forward. I'm here to also speak on behalf of. I'm here to also speak on behalf of. The Labor Outreach of Working Group of Occupy Wall Street. The Labor Outreach Working Group of Occupy Wall Street. There's some great news. There's some great news. About 2,000 people are coming here. About 2,000 people are coming here. In about 15 minutes. There are people from across New York City's unions. There are people from across New York City's unions. And they are here in support of students and teachers. And they are here in support of students and teachers. What we want to do is invite you all. What we want to do is invite you all to participate in a day of action today. To participate in a day of action today against banks. Against banks. Yeah. At 2 p.m. right here. At 2 p.m. right here. We encourage for two different groups. We encourage for two different groups to perform creative actions. To perform creative actions at two bank locations nearby. At two bank locations nearby. There's information here. There's information here. That I'll pass around about student loan debt. That I'll pass around about student loan debt. And how we need to drop it. And how we need to drop it. So I encourage you all to stick around here at 2 p.m. for the actions. So I encourage you all to stick around here at 2 p.m. for the actions. Participate at that time. Participate at that time. And then participate in the 5 p.m. Times Square Convergence. And then participate in the 5 p.m. Times Square Convergence. I adore all of you. Hi. Hi. I'm Nikki. I'm Nikki. I go to the CUNY Ground Center. I go to the CUNY Ground Center. For those of you. For those of you. Who have been craving. Who have been craving. And waiting. And waiting. Most patiently. Most patiently. For more occupations. For more occupations. Me, to meet me in the fountain, in in the the fountain, fountain inside the fountain, inside the fountain, behind the gates, behind the gates, afterwards, afterwards.
should go. You should go. To Times Square today. To Times Square today. At five. At five. With a warm coat. With a warm coat. Some running shoes. Some running shoes. And maybe a tarp. And maybe a tarp. Because. Because. There are planned occupations. There are planned occupations. Hello, my name is Olaf. Hello, my name is Olaf. I'm a recent graduate of the Hunter Integrated Media Arts MFA program. I'm a recent graduate of the Hunter Integrated MFA Arts program. <laughs> Where I studied. Where I studied. Nonfiction media for social change. Nonfiction media for social change. I'm here to let you know about an effort. I'm here to let you know about an effort that is ongoing. That is ongoing. Create a modern citizen lawmaking process in New York City. To create a modern citizen lawmaking process in New York City. So that we can create processes using the technology we have today. So that we can create processes using the technology we have today. That allow citizens to draft legislation. That allow citizens to draft legislation. And place it on the ballot. And place it on the ballot. For the citizenry to pass. For the citizenry to pass. And for the citizens to debate. And for the citizens to debate. In a space that is not money driven. In a space that is not money driven. Or nor limited by the logistics of space and the amount of people that can participate. Nor limited by the logistics of space and how many people that can participate. Hell yeah. Right now. Right now. We are still drafting the necessary charter amendments. We are still drafting the necessary charter amendments. It is a legal minefield ahead of us. It is a legal minefield ahead of us. But next year we will be gathering signatures. But next year we will be gathering signatures. To place the necessary amendments on the ballot. To place the necessary amendments on the ballot. We would love your support. We and would your love input. your support. And your input. And your input. You can find out more at lowercased.org. You can find out more at lowercased.org. That's spelled out lowercase. That's spelled out lowercase. And the letter D. And the letter D. I love you guys. I love you. Hi, my name is Jason. Hi, my name is Jason. And I'm the president of Teamsters Local 814. And I'm the president of Teamsters Local 814. And down at Occupy Wall Street. And down at Occupy Wall Street. We are finally seeing. We are finally seeing. Organized labor in New York. Organized labor in New York. Students. Students. And radical movements. And radical movements. Coming together. Coming together. To further all of our interests. To further all of our interests. Right now at Sotheby's. Right now. A shopping mall for the super rich. A shopping mall for the super rich. Forty-three of my members. Forty-three of my members have been out on the street for two and a half months. Have been out on the street for two and a half months. They are mostly people of color. They are mostly people of color. And they need your help. And they need your help. Occupy Wall Street has already. Occupy Wall Street has already disrupted their auctions. Disrupted their auctions. And occupied the front of their building. And occupied the front of their building. We are having a rally this Thursday. We are having a rally this Thursday. At 1.30 p.m. At 1.30 p.m. In front of Sotheby's on the Upper East Side. In front of Sotheby's on the Upper East Side. There are going to be lots of extremely wealthy people there. There. And guess who they don't want to see? And guess who they don't want to see? Ah! Ah! I'll be standing here. I'll be standing here. After this meeting. After this meeting. Come up and talk to me. Come up and talk to me. And take a leaflet. And take a leaflet. And you should know. And you should know. That organized labor. That organized labor. Is going to be behind this thing. Is going to be behind this thing. Meeting this movement, meeting this movement in New York City. In New York City. We are New York City teachers. We are New York City teachers. We are also. We are also students. Students in the urban education program. In the urban education program at the CUNY Graduate Center. At the CUNY Graduate Center. I used to work on Wall Street. I used to work on Wall Street. But that does not make me. But that does not make me a bad person. A bad person. A corporation. A corporation. 
corporation is not a person. Is not a person. Despite what they may claim. Despite what they may claim. We brought students. We brought students. Raise your hands. If you are a high school student. If you are a high school student. Please raise your hand. Please raise your hand. The youth are not just the future. The youth are not just the future. They are the present. 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 Hello everyone. Hello everyone. My name is Christina. My name is Christina. I'm an environmental activist at Columbia University. Of my debt. They can't handle the majority of my debt. We need to understand. We need to understand that education, that education is a right for the people. Is a right for the people. Not a privilege. Not a privilege. Thank you. Yeah. Oh my God. Oh my God. Hi, I'm Matt from Columbia. Hi, I'm Matt from Columbia. Um, I. I, I've been helping to organize with two different groups on campus. I've been helping to organize with two different groups on campus. The International Socialist Organization. The International Socialist Organization. And Students for Justice in Palestine. And Students for Justice in Palestine. This weekend. This weekend. There are hundreds of students. There are hundreds of students. From all over the country. From all over the country. At Columbia. At Columbia. 
for the first Students for Justice in Palestine National Conference. For the first Students for Justice in Palestine National Conference. In over a decade. In over a decade. <laughs> this is. Oh, shit, I'm so nervous. <laughs> Wall Street. For Occupy Wall Street. To look around. To look around. And see the kind of movements we can be connected to. And see the kind of movements we can be connected to. There is a massive movement for building solidarity with Palestinians. There is a massive movement for building solidarity with Palestinians. We all saw what happened to Troy Davis. We all saw what happened to Troy Davis. We need to build connections to the movement against what's happening uh, to the criminal justice system. We need to build connections to what is happening in the criminal justice system. Okay. Um, and to the amazing organizers that put together Slut Walk. And to the amazing organizers that put together Slut Walk. Um, I want to make an announcement about one place that I think is important for bringing together. I want to make an announcement about one place that's important for bringing together. Different ideas and struggles. Different ideas and struggles. There's a conference at Columbia. There's a conference at Columbia. In a couple weeks. In a couple weeks. It's a conference around Marxism. It's a conference around Marxism. And there's a number of different talks. And there's a number of different talks. On everything. On everything. From economics. From economics. To racism. To racism. And sexism. And sexism. I love these big meetings. I love these big meetings. But I also love being able to sit down. But I also love being able to sit down. And debate out. And debate out. And talk to people like you. And talk to people like you. About our ideas. About our ideas. And what sort of demands. And what sort of demands. And what kind of world. And what kind of world. We want to see. We want to see. So consider this an opportunity. So consider this an opportunity. And come see me. And come see me. If you want more information. Hey everybody! Hey everybody! My name is Will. My name is Will. I organize with many groups. I organize with many groups. The International Socialist Organization. The International Socialist Organization. Students United for Free CUNY. Students United for Free CUNY. New York Students Rising. New York Students Rising. I am a graduate student. I am a graduate student. At Hunter College. At Hunter College. This year. This year. The federal government. The federal Got rid of, got rid of subsidized, loans subsidized loans for graduate students. For graduate students. This will cost me, this will cost me thousands, and thousands of dollars. thousands and thousands of dollars. Who suffers more than I do? Who suffers more than I do? The poor and marginalized communities. The poor and marginalized communities of New York City. Of New York City. That are being displaced. That are being displaced from their own publication, public education system. From their own public education system. We need to organize. We need to organize to be in solidarity with. To be in solidarity with. And outreach to. And outreach to the most marginalized communities in the city. The most marginalized communities in the city. These people work. These people work. They have kids. They have kids. They don't always have time. They don't always have time. We need to be welcoming. We need to be welcoming to the people. To the people who do not have. Who do not have the privilege. The privilege to spend three hours. To spend three hours in a meeting. In a meeting. As beautiful as it is. That also includes the workers. That also includes the workers. Thank you very much. Hi, I'm Jack. Hi, Jack. Hi, Jack. Hi, Jack. Hi, Jack. Hi, Jack. Hi, I'm Jennifer. Hi, I'm Jennifer. Um, I'm a mom. Yeah.
This is my last semester of school. This is my last semester of school. And I will graduate with over $26,000 in debt at almost 50 years old. And I will graduate with almost $26,000 in debt at 50 years old. My daughter will graduate with almost $20,000 of debt. My daughter will graduate with almost $20,000 of debt. For one of my projects, I started this summer an online magazine. For one of my projects, I started this summer an online magazine. Called American Made Magazine. Called American Made Magazine. The hope was not about buying stuff, but rethinking America. The hope was not about buying stuff, but rethinking America. Right now, right now, we have three people left on the stack. We have three people left on the stack. And we know there are thousands coming to join us. And we know there are thousands coming to join us. So we're going to take these three announcements. So we're going to take these three announcements. And we're going to close the student assembly. And we're going to close the student assembly. We're going to ask the last three to come up. We're going to ask the last three. Oh, right, right, check. Right, 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 check. Right, My name is Nate. My name is Nate. I'm a senior. I'm a senior at Champlain College. At Champlain College in Burlington, Vermont. In Burlington, Vermont. Four of us drove down here. Four of us drove down here. We are here today. We are here today to bring some of the energy from here. To bring some of the energy from here and bring it to Vermont. And bring it to Vermont. Peers and share it with our fellow peers who show up every Wednesday. Who show up every Wednesday. And the 500 in Burlington. And the 500 in Burlington that occupies City Hall Park. That occupies City Hall Park every Sunday. Every Sunday. If you want to contact us, if you want to contact us, our Facebook page. Our Facebook page is Champlainers Occupy Burlington. Is Champlainers Occupy Burlington. We are students. We are students. We are the 99%. We are the 99%. You're all awesome. You're all awesome. Uh, Michael with Labor Outreach. Michael with Labor Outreach. Hello. Hello. My name is Michael Letwin. My name is Michael Letwin. I'm former president of UAW Local 2325. I'm former president of UAW Local 2325. <laughs> legal aid attorneys in New York City. Legal aid attorneys in New York City. And I'm also with New York City Labor Against the War. And I'm also with New York City Labor Against the War. And Labor for Palestine. And Labor for Palestine. And I'm very proud of you all. I'm very proud of you all. As a former student activist, as a, former student activist as a parent of students, as a parent, and I'm also particularly proud to see the increasing diversity of this movement. Of this movement. Whether it's people of color in this country, whether it's people of color in this country, and the connections being made to movements around the world. Above all in Palestine. Above all in Palestine. Which was the Heart, which was the heart that gave rise, that gave rise to the movements of the Arab Spring, to the movements of the Arab Spring, which this now reflects. Which this now reflects. Now reflects. So this movement is all about. So this movement is all about connections, connections between students, between students, workers, workers, people of color, people of color, ending the wars, ending the wars in Iraq. In, in, Afghanistan, in Afghanistan, all around the world, all around the world, to ending the occupation of all of historic Palestine, to ending the occupation of all of historic Palestine, to ending the racism of the criminal justice system in this country, to ending the criminal justice system in this country, 
Finally, I just want to say that as a public defender in Brooklyn, every day I represent young people of color who are in the criminal justice system, being criminalized for charges, big and small, and not one of them works on Wall Street. Mic check! Mic check! Hi! Hi! I'm Lewis! I'm Lewis! I'm from Occupy Wall Street! I'm from Occupy Wall Street! Direct action! Direct, Direct action! action. I, recommend I recommend that you all, that you all come join, come join us, us in our action, in our action at the banks, at the banks today, today at 2 p.m. At 2 p.m. Because in many ways, because in many ways, this fight, this fight is about the banks! It's about the banks! Organizations and groups. Find the organizations and groups. Stay safe. Stay safe. 